In this tutorial, we'll learn how to create dynamic column headers in Power BI based on a slicer selection. Let's take a look at our example table. As you can see, we have a table with fixed column headers for last year's sales and this year's sales. However, we want to make these headers dynamic based on a slicer selection, allowing us to switch between different fiscal years effortlessly. Step 1. Go to the Modeling tab, select Parameter, and choose Field Parameter. Step 2. In the New Parameter dialog, pick the last year sales and this year sales measures and uncheck Add Slicer to this page. After that, a parameter is created. The table contains three columns, the name to display in the slicer, the name of the column that needs to be used, and the sort order. Step 3. To create a table visual with dynamic column headers, instead of inputting last year's sales and this year's sales measures, we'll pick the parameter. This way, we'll get the same result. Now, it's time for the interesting part. We'll adjust this parameter to get the result we want. We'll add one more column that shows the year and change the parameter name to match the selected year. You can add more rows to your parameter for additional years. To make this dynamic, create a relationship between the parameter and your date data. Link them by the year column. And there you have it. You've successfully created a dynamic table with column headers that change based on the slicer selection. Your Power BI report is now more flexible and user-friendly.